Are you guys excited? For those of you who joined us in the room, we gave out a million dollars to every person who got here on time today, so I'm really sorry for those of you who didn't make it here. I apologize for that, but you just have to get signed up. Uh, if you have CLE forms, you need, to, you need to turn those in before you leave, or you don't get any credit, and you will be disbarred, thrown out, and then you'll wind up having to shave your head and do events like this with me. Uh, how many of you have had an opportunity to listen to Frankie Finn? Great. Now, for those of you who haven't, you're in for a real treat. I, just, I love this guy's name because it reminds me of a character from an Italian mobster movie. Hey, have you talked to Frankie Finn lately? <laughs> Doesn't it sound like that? Well, he wanted me to let you know that I'm supposed to introduce him by telling you he's handsome, he's good looking, he's charming, and he's an incredibly intelligent guy. So will you please help me welcome the guy playing him today, Mr. Frankie Finn. <laughs> That was beautiful, Ron. Oh, man, my what mom walks faster than that, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're man hugging in front of everybody. That's man love. So this presentation begins like every great presentation. What are these strawberries doing on my nipples? I need them for the fruit salad. Uh, a couple of you guys actually had me look at your websites on the break, and I promise you would not have done that if you knew I could see your Google search history. <laughs> but we're actually going to talk about somebody who's a whole lot more judgmental than that. Maybe I should just go up here. Which is your end client. So I want you guys to do a little experiment with me right now. And I'm going to show you a couple lawyer advertisements and I'm just going to show you very briefly, and I want you to raise your hand when you've made a judgment about them, whether you think they could help you, you get the gist of what they're about, and whether or not you would actually choose them as a lawyer. And now a second one here says, we don't just look like lawyers, we are lawyers. <laughs> and how about this one? Injured, don't pull your hair out, my bald lawyer. <laughs> a couple of bald guys are like, I'd, he's definitely my guy, right? So the point of that is, is really, it only took us a few seconds to decide whether I want to do business with you, whether I'm going to be your potential client. And what I want you guys to do is make such a wow first impression that you take your clients and turn them from disapproval cat into approval cat. So that's, that's li this highly technical presentation, as you guys can tell. And so what we like to do is, is, you know, really one of the magic things I've met about Ken is that he loves to be able to take a dollar in advertising and predictably turn it into six and ten dollars. And when you spend a dollar to make six, guess how often you can do that? Just out of curiosity, anybody here know just on average, um, if you run a paid Google campaign, what percentage of people will pick up the phone and call you? Anybody want to hazard a guess? It's, it's a little over four percent. Uh, by the way, is Gary Musler in the room? My eyes. Oh, Gary. Yeah, Gary's actually running uh, landing pages right now that complete strangers on Google are converting at 31%. Is that correct, Gary? Yeah. Which means basically one out of every three strangers who visits his website actually picks up the phone and calls. And so just imagine what kind of multiple that can make for you. And so what we see is because people are judging you so quickly that you can have two to five x improvements in everything you're doing with no, uh, no change in your cost simply by making a better first impression with the landing page. So I want to show you some stuff really quickly, rapid fire. In three to seven seconds, I've already decided I don't want to do business with him. And I want you to compare that to, say, Ken's website. Now, the beautiful thing about this kind of positioning is, well, when Ken does his SSD, he already knows that when somebody types in social security disability, guess what they're interested in, right? So when he sends them to a website, you know, he immediately greets them with how to double your chances of winning your SSD case. And of course, he, he does a free book offer. And so I want you guys to really think about that because it, it's very, very simple with paid traffic to know why they're coming to talk to you, right? They type in things like car accident lawyer. They type in things like motorcycle lawyer. They type in things like trucking accident, right? So these things allow you to know what they're looking for. So I want you to... If you're going to make the right first impression, it starts with just simply being a match with the reason why they're there. You know, I've seen a lot of you guys 
um, when you showed me your website, leading with your phone number or like an SEO tag or just the generic, hey, welcome to our website. And how many of you guys, just by the way, when you read a website, scan it really quickly and then decide if you're going to actually read it? Every one of you, and you're not raising your hands because you're liars. Yeah. <laughs> right? So it, statistically, about 80% of people, and it's higher with lawyers because we're busy, you don't even stop them in the headline. They're not reading the rest. This is an awesome website from a lawyer who works with us here at Pilma, and it just says, a true story of how one tragic event changed a young man's life for the better. Listen in. Can you see how that, like, if you're reading that, it just really pulls you in and makes you want to read the rest of the website? Another big thing I see on landing pages is this is an example of horrible contrast. The whole point of a landing page, what is it? It's to make somebody either fill out a form or pick up the phone and call, right? So the most important thing on this website isn't all this gibberish that looks like it was made in 1995. It's the phone number, right? Or what they want you to do next. Henry Ford has a famous saying, um, the customer can have any color he wants so long as it's black. This is, you can, have any, you can do anything you want on my website so long as it's call me. This guy absolutely dominates his market and uh, there isn't even a cl close second place. And he does it just by sending people to the same landing page over and over and over and it does all the heavy lifting for him. Uh, another one, voted best law firm, voted best attorney. Again, that's not him saying it, right? So it doesn't sound you know, the same kind of thing if he bragged and, and opened a video and said, I'm the best lawyer in the country. He would sound completely full of himself. At the end of the day, what I want you to do is be making the, the best first impression that you can make because they're judging you. Actually, statistically, 50% of people are going to leave your website in 7 to 10 seconds. So don't be this guy, the butt hurt guy. <laughs> Unless, of course, you, you, know, you specialize in butt injury, so maybe you want to be him. Um, you can email me after. Frankie, thank you so much. Let's hear yeah. it for Frankie one more time. Yeah.